now to WA, where the Health Minister Amber Jade Sanderson is a step closer to replacing Mark McGowan as Premier after receiving the vital backing of unions. Danica DiGiorgio is at the WA Parliament. Danica, what happens from here? Well, Kieran, an emergency caucus meeting will be held. We don't know when, though, but that's essentially where members can nominate themselves for the leadership after that position was vacated by the very popular Premier, Mark McGowan. But Amber Jade Sanderson, as you mentioned earlier there, she is now the front runner. She's the health minister, and today she won an all-important ballot by the Labor left faction, the dominant faction led by the United Workers' Union. She won the ballot. They've given her her support support for her to take on that leadership role. This is what she said as she emerged from that meeting. Uh, we've had our meeting this morning. Uh, I've been chosen uh, with a clear majority uh, to be the candidate to go forward uh, for the leadership. Uh, I will now reach out to my colleagues. I will now reach out to my colleagues across the caucus with a focus on unity and stability. Uh, we will continue those conversations. I will respect the process and we'll have more to say later in that process. Thank you. She was up against the Deputy Premier, Roger Cook, for that ballot. Both are actually aligned, though, with the United Workers' Union. One-third of the Labor caucus is made up from that union. So this is why today's vote was essentially a kingmaker. Roger Cook was on the front foot early. He began a media blitz on local radio, spruiking his own credentials, and he said that, actually, he was confident that he would win today. However, he didn't. He left in a haste. And now this is where things get quite complicated, because in the event he does still nominate, he refuses to back down, nominates at that caucus meeting, it would start a process which would take a month because every member of the rank and file now will have to vote. Another one to watch, though, is Rita Safiotti, the Transport Minister. Now, last night she was working the phones, trying to drum up support. She's yet to formally announce her intentions, but there's just been some reports in the West Australian newspaper that Roger Cook could run with her uh, as her running mate. So that will be one to watch. Kieran, this afternoon, the Australian Manufacturing Workers' Union will also meet here in Perth. That's uh, another faction of the Labor Party. They will decide whether they also back Amber Jade's Sanderson. Uh, if they do, it will make it very difficult for Roger Cook and Rita Safiotti, and it will probably mean that Amber Jade Sanderson really is that front runner to take on the role of Premier, a role that a female has not received since Carmen Lawrence. Danica, yeah, interesting developments and all out of the blue yesterday. Thank you for that.